Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of stuff like that. Um, when I was working for the guy in La Jolla, right, the whole thing was reciprocal links, right? So we we were using our list to create um, reciprocal link directories of, of relevant um, uh, relevant sites. And so in order to get ranked for Las Vegas hotels, um, I did a lot of reciprocal links with Las Vegas sites. And then I did a lot of reciprocal links with hotels outside of Las Vegas. And so the combination of that Las Vegas link connectivity and that hotel link connectivity really powered the travel site that I was working on to, to get listed. Um, and of course, you know, that, that was the early days of sort of page rank and, um, you know, the page, uh, reading the page rank algorithm and understanding how that worked and, uh, you know, pay attention, paying attention to the page rank bar whenever it updated and, and all of these kinds of things. So that's definitely one area that's changed a lot over the years is that even though links are still a big part of um, the, the ranking algorithm, there's a ton of other stuff. And really, in, in the last two or three years, the intent of your content uh, and um, and the ability of your content to meet the needs of the average person that's looking for your content has really become a, a huge part of uh, Google's ranking algorithm. And uh, I think that's a that's one of a number of huge changes that have been um, that have occurred since since the early days of you know 2005 2006.